favor. No, por favor. Good evening. 
Good evening. Good evening, people. Everybody. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, Carlos. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. <clears throat> How are you today, people? Are you okay? Ready for a new class? Please remember to write your full name. You need to write your full name on the screen. Don't be selfish. Don't be stingy. No sean tacaños. Write your full name. Okay, people, let's get started this, this evening. I'm going to take the first the attendance of the evening. And I see <clears throat> new faces today. So I will ask you to introduce yourself, yourselves to the, to the group, please. Yesterday, we introduce ourselves in the class, but some of you uh, were not in class yesterday, so I will ask you to introduce yourselves today. All right. Okay, so let's get started with Alba Janet Jimenez. Alba Janet Jimenez, not here yet. Andrea Sofia Benitez. Present teacher. Oh, hi Andrea. 
Okay. We missed you yesterday. Could you introduce yourself, please? Yes. And um, ayer no pude asistir porque vine tarde a mi casa por el tráfico de la lluvia que hubo caos total en San Salvador. Ah, okay, okay. Puedes presentarte tu nombre, de dónde eres, dónde trabajas, un poco acerca de ti. Okay, uh, my name is Andreas Benitez. I am uh, 29 years old. Um, I am working in immobiliary. Um, I, I am living in San Bartolo y Lopango. Um, only. Okay, very good. Welcome, Andrea. Thank you. Carlos Ernesto Perez. Present teacher. Okay. Consuelo Saraí Rivas. Present teacher. Okay. Good evening. Eric Edenilson Escobar. Erika de Nilsson. Not here again. Eric Jose Hernandez. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. welcome. Fanny Judith Palacios. Fanny Judith, not here. Hey people, remember you have to be with your camera on. Turn on your cameras, please. Herman Enrique Gonzalez. Herman Enrique Gonzalez. Well, not responding. Jennifer Lisset Aquino. Present. Ah, okay, Herman. Okay, Jennifer, could you please introduce yourself to the class? Um, my name is Jennifer. I work in Outstanding. Uh, I, I am accounting. Uh, I live in Soyapango. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Uh, uh, uh. Jose Abel Isaguirre. Here, present teacher. Uh, I have two devices. Okay. Jose Miguel Massa. Present. Welcome. Karina Elizabeth Hernandez. Are you here? Barely hear you. Okay. Te escucha suave, pero sí te escuché, Karina. Magdiel Esaú García. Present, present teacher. Ok, welcome. Apagar eso ya. Pedro Alexander Osorto. Present teacher. Ok. Raúl Arturo Esquivel. Present teacher. Do you have any problem with your camera, Raúl? Raúl, do you have problem with your camera? Ah, oh, no, I thought, huh? Okay. Eh, Reinaldo Antonio Fernández. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Wendy Lisette Gomez. Present. Okay, welcome Wendy. Could you please introduce yourself to the class? Este, ayer salí del hospital. Okay, I'm sorry for that. Cuéntanos un poco de ti, de dónde eres, dónde trabajas, qué haces. Este, uh, my name is Wendy Gómez. Um, living in Ocus Capitán. Y uh, I'm work in uh, Pronto, en Merliot. Okay. Okay, Wendy. I hope you feel better today. Wendy Maricela Ramírez. No sé. Tanto que cuesta. Okay, welcome. Uh, Wilber Alberto Pérez. Present, teacher. Okay, William Alexander Paniagua. Present, teacher. Good. Blanca Alejandra Portillo. Blanca Alejandra is not here today. And Henry Alberto Perez. Present teacher. Okay, very good. I, I am Leo. Okay, no problem. Alba Janet, are you here now? Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Erika de Nilsson. Todavía no. Fanny y bueno, okay, very good. So welcome people one more time. Let's continue today, okay? Last night we started um, working on the on the first lesson. Just let me, okay, here and here. We started with the first lesson. We practiced the conversation. Just let me read it once to refresh our minds about this. Did you hear about the visit of the manager today? I did. We should be ready to answer questions about the mission and the vision of the company. Let's read them. Okay, our mission is to make our guests Feel at home from check-in to check-out. Right. Our mission describes why our business exists. And our vision is to become the most preferred beach hotel by families by 2020. That's right. Our vision tells where our business wants to get in the future. Good. Do you uh, remember what is this form of the verb? How do we call this form of the verb? ¿Cómo se llama esta forma verbal? Cuando decimos to make, to become. Infinito, infinitivo. Infinitivo, correcto. Is the infinitive, ¿verdad? The infinitive. Es eh, como cuando el verbo está sin conjugar. ¿no? Our mission is to make our guests feel at home. Hacer. ¿Verdad? Eh, our vision is to become. O volver. O, o convertirse. ¿Verdad? That is the form of these verbs. We use 
as you see, this form to uh, describe the visions and the mission of a company. We have here some mission statements of some companies. Uh, the companies are Chevron, Starbucks, Amazon, and Nike. The, we, we have these visions here. Let me read the visions first, just to um, show you the pronunciation of this. Okay. Let me uh, present or record the, the uh, oh, 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 okay. Let me record this so you can practice the the pronunciation a to be the most customer centric company in the world where people can find and discover anything they want to buy online b to be the global energy company most admired for its people partnership and performance b to bring inspiration and innovation to every athlete in the world. D, to inspire and nurture the human spirit, one person, one cop, and one neighborhood at a time. So here we have the, wish, the mission statements of these four companies. I want you to match the vision with the company. Okay, so I will give you a few minutes in groups to do this exercise, okay, to complete this activity. So let me form small groups. There are 19, okay, I'm going to form six groups. Join your groups, please, and complete that exercise okay you have to match the missions with the companies join your groups please and i'll give you five minutes to do it work together please join your groups
Okay, let's see. Okay, let me see. Uh, Carlos, could you please read the first mission? Okay. okay. To be the most customer centric company in the world where people can find and discover anything they want to buy online. Okay. What company is this? Is in Amazon. Amazon. Okay. Okay, let's make a line here. Good, thank you. Um, Andrea, would you read the, the second, please? Second mission. Okay. Letter B, uh, to be the global, global energy company most admired for its people, partnership, partnership, and performance. Okay, which one? Uh, the company is um, Chevron. Chevron. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Now, uh, Let's see. Wilbur, could you read number three, please? To bring inspiration and innovation to every athlete in the world. That's Company? Nike. Nike. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Jose. And Henry, letter D, please. To inspire and nurture the human spirit, one person, one cup, and one neighborhood at a time. And that is? Starbucks. Starbucks, correct. Say what happened? Okay. Okay, very good. Let me raise my lines. Ah, no se quiere borrar. Ah, ¿qué pasó? No, yo no quería borrar esas. Ah, yo las quité, teacher. <laughs> las pongo. Okay, devole acá ya rapidito. Inspiration, Nike, and Star. Okay, very good. So, if you see in these missions, we have the... Hello, teacher. Hello, hello. Uh, le pido permiso unos 15 minutos de trasladarme hacia mi casa, teacher. Ah, and you are... Ajá, para participar, que me voy a mover de otra casa a mi casa. Uh, ¿Quién es? ¿Quién habla? Wendy Ramírez. Ah, ok, Wendy. Gracias, teacher. Bueno. El hey, profe tenía que aplicarme la que me aplicó a mí la vez pasada. Qué voz. Ah, no, olvídenlo, a ver si se acuerda después. Celoso. Ah, ah, ah. Okay. La <risa> You see, we have infinitives here, okay? To describe the mission statements, we use infinitives. Good. Let's take a look on this topic. How to use infinitives? How to use infinitives, okay? We have these verbs here in this uh, exercise, the verbs to make, to come, to be, to bring, to inspire. 
So we use this form. Yeah, to make, to become, to be, to bring, to inspire. Um, this is the infinity form. We use to plus the base form of the verb. That is what we call infinity. Infinitives are used to express purpose. Yeah, this is to to express purpose, like in mission statements. Example, why does the company exist? To bring inspiration and innovation to every athlete in the world. We express purpose. Infinitives are also used to express direction, like in vision statements. Where is the company going? Well, our vision is to become the most preferred beach hotel by families by 2020. So we use uh, infinitives to express purpose and to express direction. Purpose and direction. Yeah, purpose to bring direction to be yes any question here people okay if not please work on this exercise okay you have to uh, correct the errors there are some errors in this exercise not all the sentences have mistakes. Some sentences are correct. So if the sentence is correct, don't touch it. But the incorrect sentences, please correct the errors. You have to mark the error or the mistake and correct it. All right. I'll give you a um, few minutes to do it, do it in groups again. Let me send you to your groups, let me recreate. We are how many? Okay. Uh, Okay. Okay, go to your groups and, and work on exercise, what number is? Five. Work on exercise five together.
Okay, let's check. So the example, number one is the example, okay? Our mission is to become the number one provider of office supplies in San Miguel. So two is missing. Falta y two, ¿verdad? Y ahí se lo colocaron. Number two. <clears throat> okay, let me see. Okay, Jose Aver, can you read number two, please? Okay, teacher. Um, our mission is to provide healthy, tasty, and economic yes. meals to construction workers, wherever they are. Okay, first, is the sentence correct? Or it's correct. is there a mistake? It's correct. It's correct. Okay. Yes, you're right. Sentence two is correct. Let me check. Good. Now, Blanca, can you read sentence three, please? Blanca Alejandra. Yes, teacher. Um, let me see. We aim to be the number one cleaning service provide for finan financial institutions. Okay. Is it correct I think or wrong? That is correct. Okay, yes, you're right. Number three is correct. Because we have the uh, We have the infinitive, yes? So to provide, to be, okay. Thank you. Wendy Lisette, what about number four? Can you read number four, please? We are sent to bring uh, bringing telecommunication solution of this business in rural areas. Is it correct or wrong? Mm. Wendy, correct or incorrect? Incorrect. Incorrect. Yeah. Yes. Okay. What is the mistake, people? Okay. Okay. Wait. Wait a minute, Jose. Please don't don't go too fast. Jose, please don't do that. Don't go too fast, Jose. Vamos a esperar. Thank you. <laughs> Lo siento, teacher, por querer borrarme. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that is the, the error, yes, because the correct form is to bring. To bring. Okay, Henry, you want to read number four? Eh, no, quiero consultar. Bueno, si la leo. Uh -huh. El error okay. es porque debe de llevar la forma base del verbo, ¿verdad? Exacto. Es to bring. Okay. Ajá. No debe de ir el ING. Mm -hmm. Okay. Eh, I read. Eh, yes. We envision be leader in the distribution of energy drinks in the regional market. Okay, is it correct or incorrect? We envision be. Incorrect. 
Incorrect. A mí le falta el tú. Le, le falta, ajá, correcto, le falta el verbo. El complemento del verbo. El complemento. Ok, le falta el tú. Tú. Yes. Yes. Pitita, para que quepa ahí. Tú. Tú, tú, tú. Un poquito más grande. Ahí está. Aquí, ¿verdad? Ahí le falta el to. We envision to be leaders in the distribution of energy drinks in the regional market. Great. Um, now let me ask to... Uh, let me see, let me see. Okay, uh, Jennifer, Lisette, number six. Can you read number six, please? Honey's vision is to become the most preferred hair salons for adolescents. Correct or incorrect? Incorrect. Incorrect. Yes. What is the problem with that sentence? Uh, ING del verbo. Yes. No está la forma yes. Becoming. Okay. Well, de hecho, hay que escribirlo porque no es solo become. Mm, the correct form is to become. Where become. Is, yes. Be yeah. To become. My company's vision is to become the most preferred hair salon for adults. Very good. Any question, people? No? Great. Okay, let me read these sentences and then we are going to practice the pronunciation. One, our vision is to become the number one provider of office supplies in San Miguel. Two, our mission is to provide healthy, test, tasty, and economic meals to construction workers wherever they are. Three, we aim to be the number one cleaning service provider for financial institutions. Four, we exist to bring telecommunication solutions for businesses in rural areas. Five, we envision to be leaders in the distribution of energy drinks in the regional market. Six, my company's vision is to become the most preferred hair salon for adolescents. Okay, you have the pronunciation in the book. Let me mark this with X because this is correct. Okay, let's practice the pronunciation, please. Repeat after me. Our vision is to become the number one provider of office supplies in San Miguel. Our vision is, is to become the number one provider of office supplies in Samuel. Two, our mission is to provide healthy, tasty, and economic meals to construction workers wherever they are. 
Three, we aim to be the number one cleaning service provider for financial institutions. We, are, we aim we to, be to be the number, number one, one cleaning service provider for financial institutions. Four, we exist to bring telecommunication solutions for businesses in rural areas. We, we exist, exist to bring telecommunication solutions for businesses in areas. areas. Five, we envision to be leaders in the distribution of energy drinks in the regional market. We envision to be the leader in the distribution of energy in the regional market. Six, my company's vision is to become the most preferred hair salon for adolescents. My company's vision is to become the most preferred hair salon for adolescents. Okay, any question, people? ¿Cómo se pronuncia bien, bien esa? Uh, que está como hair salon hair cómo es esa palabra hair hair esa. salon hair salon hair salon hair salon okay mm -hmm. esta niña Jennifer no me enseña bien <laughs> anything else Michelle yes en la número dos eh... Healthly, no sé si se pronuncia así. Healthy. Fee, como con Z. Healthy. Healthy, tasty, and economic meals. Yeah. Healthy. Fee. Es un sonido. Al final dice. No. Y, no. Este sonido es, tiene que ser un, este sonido TH, acá suena como, espérame, espérame, como si fuera una Z. Healthy. Healthy. Yeah. Any other question? Okay. Ahí les dejé el audio de estas oraciones también en el WhatsApp. Van a escuchar y practicar. Okay, now the next activity is this. Let me read the, the activity. It says, uh, choose your local company, or a local company, or think of your own. Write an effective mission and vision statement for it. Assess your mission and vision statement using the checklist in the box. Okay, look at this. We have here some mission uh, or some uh, characteristics of the, of the mission and the vision, yeah? 
So the mission statements, la declaración de misión, should be original, memorable, succinct, and related to the staff. So you are going to write the, the mission of one company or your company. It's up to you, okay? The idea is to write the mission of one company. And you have to check, is it original? Yes. Is it memorable? Yes. Is it succinct? Yes. What means this, teacher? Succinct. Mm. Succinct is like a, like brief. Let me suggest you also a website for you. Every English student must have a good dictionary. And this website is excellent as a dictionary. Can you see it? It is called Word Reference. Wordreference.com. Okay, you have a lot of languages here. Español, fran francés, italiano, portugués, catalán, alemán, y otros acá. Well, we are interested in English and Spanish. Okay. Let's take a look to that word, succinct. Here it is. You see, you have the pronunciation. U.S. English, American English, United Kingdom, Irish, different accents. Jamaican, but we are interested. Okay. The meaning, principal translation, succinto, breve. Okay. Y aquí tienen este, se los dejo, tomen nota, wordreference.com. Okay. You can use it all the time. Es bueno tener estas herramientas porque pues no siempre está alguien cerca que nos diga. Y ahí ustedes pueden buscar. Incluso como ven, la mayoría tiene la pronunciación. Ok, so. And you're going to write, well, so you're going to write an effective mission and vision of one company. And you have to assess, assess is evaluate your mission and vision with this characteristic. Okay. The vision is about the future. Is it directional? Is it descriptive? Okay. Well, you're going to do this in, in groups, in small groups. But before, before that, I need to take the second attendance of the evening. Okay. So let me call your name. Alba Janet Jimenez. Alba Janet Jimenez. Okay. 
Yes. Okay. Yes, present, okay. future. <laughs> Andrea Sofía Benítez. Present teacher. Ok, Andrea Sofía, la sesión personal de 10 minutos al final de la clase sería con usted este día. Carlos Ernesto Pérez. Present teacher. Ok, Consuelo Saray Rivas. Present teacher. Good, Erika Denilson Escobar. Eric José Hernández. Present teacher. Fanny Judith Palacios. Present teacher. Ok. Germán Enrique González. Germán Enrique González. Jennifer Lisset Aquino. Present. Ok, José Abel Izaguirre. You're present, teacher. Good. José Miguel Maza. Present. Thank you. Karina Elizabeth Hernández. Present. Thank you. Magdiel Esaú García. Present. Ok. Pedro Alexander Osorto. Present. Good. Raúl Arturo Esquivel. Present, teacher. Ok, Reinaldo Antonio Fernández. Reinaldo Antonio. Wendy Lisset Gómez. Gracias. Ok. Wendy Marisela Ramírez. Present. Ok. Wilber Alberto Pérez. Present teacher. Good. William Alexander Paniagua. Present. Ok. Blanca Alejandra Portillo. Present teacher. Good. Henry Alberto Pérez. Present teacher. Perfect. Ok. So, is the activity clear? Yes. Una visión y una misión que lleven las, las palabras que están en la caja. ¿Sí? No, no las palabras. Esas características. Ok. ¿Ya? Que sea original, que sea numerable, que sea breve y que esté relacionada con el personal. Yes. Esas son características. Ok. Mira, mira. Let's see. Let me recreate groups. We are... Okay, but I want you to, uh, I want you to prepare a, like a, a presentation, okay? So in something like this, let me show you. Look, I have here some companies, missions and visions. Yeah. These are some companies, Google. You see the mission, the vision of Google is to organize the world's information and make it universally accessible and useful. Mira que breve, que clara es la Vision. No, Harley Davidson to fulfill dreams through the experiences of motorcycling. Ya, algunas un poco más largas, pero bueno, ahí está. Entonces, I want a, a in a presentation that you write the vision and the mission of the company that you are going to. 
Aquí están algunas missions, Starbucks. Aquí está, miren, tal como está en el libro. To inspire and nurture the human spirit, one person, one common, one neighborhood at a time. Uber, make transportation as reliable as running water everywhere for everyone. Target, our mission is to make Target your preferred shopping destination in all channels. Y esta es un poco larga. Pero bueno, aquí están. Entonces, eh, en una par de diapositivas o en una, si sí, pueden hacerla y eh, luego la van a presentar. Ok. Así que lo voy a poner en parejas. Para que lo haga. Así a la hora de presentar, uno presenta la visión y el otro presenta la misión. So please join your groups. Ah, a ver, a ver, a ver. Teacher, ah, me puse en dos grupos diferentes. Eso sí, ya voy a hacer cambios ahí porque voy a mover. Ok. Ah, Alguien aquí. Y aquí. Bye. Ahí está ya. Karina, puedes entrar. Ya, ya te envié la invitación, José. Eh, me sacó del grupo en el que estaba. Pero te moví a otro. Te debe de haber llegado ya la segunda mm. invitación. Ah, un desasolador. Una, una consulta. Hola. ¿Le vamos a poner nosotros nombre a la empresa o vamos a agarrar una empresa en sí? Como quieran, si conocen la visión y la misión de alguna empresa, pueden ah, usar eso. Esa era nuestra duda. Gracias. Ok. No problem. Thank you.
Hi, teacher. Hola. Eh, fíjese que mi compañero creo que no está. <risa> oh. Ajá. Entonces aquí estoy tratando de hacerlo yo sola. Ok, probar. Sí, ahí está escribiendo, dice Germán que no puede. Mm. No me cae ningún mensaje. Ah, dice que solo está escuchando. Uh -huh. Vaya, teacher, entonces este, para eso era. Ahorita voy a tratar, estoy aquí tratando de hacer, no sé si se puede decir, teacher, en la misión. Eh, ay, no puedo pronunciar muy bien, pero voy a intentarlo. To be a eh, lady national e international. Eh, pizzería in offering fresh and quality products. Sería algo así, teacher, o, o como, sí, es como. Sí, está bien. Mm, y la visión estoy haciendo ahorita. Sería correcto decir así, como ser uh, una reconocida nacional e internacional pizzería en ofertar productos frescos y de calidad. Sí. Pues es, es como hacerla, no es de las que usted dio, ¿verdad? Sino es como hacer una propia. Sí, esa es la idea. Ser una o utilizar alguna que ya conozca, ¿no? En inglés. Ah, ah va. Ok, ticha. Puedo Exacto. copiar otra de, la, de cualquiera de las que dio. <risa> no de esas. <risa> Teacher, please. Ah, okay, teacher. Porque si está haciendo la pizzería, hágale la, de una vez las dos cosas, la misión y la visión. Ok. De una misma compañía. Ok, teacher. Ah, esa era mi duda. Entonces, pues, está bien, estaría correcta esa. Así solo hago la visión. Sí, sí, solo que ofrecer es offering. 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 Y lo demás lo dije correcto. Offering. Sí, sí, está bien. Vaya. Oh, yeah. Ok, teacher. Mm, mm. Esa era, no sé, ahorita voy a hacer la visión. Perfecto. Ay. Mm. No. Okay.
Nos dejó en la sala. Vamos a conectar. Did you finish, people? Yes. ¿Ya terminaron todos? Okay, perfect. Okay, entonces I would like to see your presentations. A ver. ¿Quién quiere empezar? ¿Qué grupo? ¿Qué pareja? Voy, voy, voy. Pero no sé si ya está lista la chica. Sí. Sí. Ok. José and Wendy. Ok, ya Wendy, you are ready? Yes. Vale. Este, me toca compartir, va. So, fue cortita, chiquita. Ya, yeah, así es. Admito que, admito que me costó, tenía años de no hacer algo de esto. Uh. Ok, es eh, Mission. Ahorita, ahorita, ahorita. Ahí está. ¿Se ve, verdad? Yes. Ahí está. We are a leading company in human development and generality and innovation. Uh. Eh, la vision y reconoce as the best in customer experience why profit up and sustain the glow grow a ver a ver déjenme la ahí déjenme eso ahí eh, ok the vision eh, sí, porque, bueno, de acuerdo a lo que estamos estudiando, ¿no? Estaría bien, acá solo puede dejarse así o podemos usar el to be, ¿verdad? Como hemos estado mencionando, ¿no? Be recognized or to be recognized as the best in customer experience. With profitable and sustainable growth. Regresemos a la, a la misión. Mm. Aquí sí quizás nos faltaría el, el infinity. Sí, porque ¿verdad? utiliza el landing. Oh, tenía razón. Uh -huh. Teníamos que haber usado la otra palabra. Verdad. Pero, ok, very good. No, no problem. Ok, así eh, los demás, si tienen eso por ahí, lo pueden okay. chequear. Perfecto, gracias, eh, José. Ahora, ¿cómo, cómo lo quito? Ah, aquí, aquí, aquí. Okay. ok, vamos a ver. José en Wendy, denme. Un número del 1 al 10. Except 5. 4. 4. Ok. Team 4 are Alba and Magdiel. Ok. Ok. Teacher, uh, nosotros hicimos la visión la misión y la visión de la alcaldía, o sea, pero como que la resumimos, uh, pero no sé si, si Mariel hizo la presentación porque nos tardamos, yo, o sea, mi iPad se me salió, ¿verdad? y pues sí las hicimos en inglés, no sé si solo quiere que se las digamos, puede Mariel hacer la misión y yo la visión, lo que nosotros hemos hecho. ¿O necesariamente tendríamos que hacer la presentación? No sé. La diapositiva. ¿No, no, la, no la lograron hacer? Solo la escribimos. No, no. no en Solo la escribimos. En algún 
documento de Word o no. Bueno, en mi cuaderno, y en el el cuaderno. Va, entonces escríbamelo en el chat aquí en el chat de Zoom escríbame va Mariela va a escribir que el mío se me traba <ríe> mi iPad Eso. Ahí está, muy bien. Vaya. Eh. ¿Quién no lee? ¿Quién de los dos no lee? Ahorita, teacher, permita. Ok. Voy a leer yo la visión en lo que Madiel pone la misión. Ok. En la visión es to make the municipality a little modern and safe a city development. Ok. And the mission. En español es lograr que el municipio sea líder, moderno, seguro y como una ciudad de desarrollo. No lo alcancé a copiar, no, 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 no lo tiene usted por ahí. Ah, ahorita voy a escribir. Tranquilos. Lo siento por haber dicho número cuatro, hubiera dicho número tres. Ahí les daba más. Sí, José, José tiene la culpa. Ay, I'm sorry. Como siempre. Teacher, in a few minutes, um, my cell phone is dead by a low battery. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> yo, yo vendo sí. baterías recargables ahí de apoyo. <laughs> uh, la, la alerta de que en cinco minutos se termina. Vaya, ok. Mientras, mientras lo escriben, eh, Magnelli Alba, la misión, ¿por qué no pasan ustedes entonces, José? Antes de que se te apague. Ok. El... Ok. Um, mi compañera tiene la diapositiva. Andrea, creo que era. Uh, 
Ahorita. La... Eh, this company, the furniture company. Mm -hmm. The mission of their quality and innovation in each, each product that it decided that everything is the functional and prices that fit the customer's pocket. Mm -hmm. Ambition, we want our business to have a positive impact on the world from the communities or materials come from to the way our products help our customers live more sustainable lives at home. Okay. And, mm -hmm. And, and the features. Oh. Innovation. Efficiency. Service to others. Responsibility. And last one, integrity. Okay. Okay, very good. Thank you, Jose and Andrea. Okay. Ya se puede morir el teléfono en paz. Sí, por la cámara nada más, porque con la máquina sí sigo. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Another group. De aquí Andrea y Sofía y, y Jose en el group number two. Bueno, los voy a escoger yo porque si no, nos agarra más la tarde y ya se nos acaba el tiempo. Eh, team One, Eric and Karina. I would like to participate. ¿Quién, quién? I would like to participate. Claro, ok. Vaya, entonces, démosle chance a que están ahí okay. con ganas. Blanca en Pedro. Adelante. Yes, but we didn't have a presentation. But we have the sentence, the, the sentence. Can I write it? Write it. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Okay. Uh... Mission is our mission is to bring a uh, good communication and innovation to every people in the world. Ah, okay. And vision is our vision is to become the leader company in creation creation of hard, hardware and software around the world. Ah, okay. Hey, very good. Thank you. Bueno, Pedro hizo ahí the, the slides. Perfect. To become a, to bring. Good. Thank you, Pedro and Blanca. Very good. A ver. Eric and Karina, please. Boy. Yes. Okay. Uh, okay. Our mission and vision group bimbo. Mm -hmm. 
the vision to be a company with a really prestigious and reliable brand for our customer and an extraordinary place to work. Okay, very good. Thank you. Henry and Wendy. Yes, uh, I share. I share. Yes. Yes. Give me a moment. The company's name is a Porsche Move. Okay. Uh, our mission is, is to provide quality and timely financial service in the private sector. Our mission to be recognized and leading company in the financial sector and highly recommended by our customers. Okay, very good. Thank you. Now let's continue with Consuelo and William. Okay. Okay. Ahorita pongo la cuestión. Bye. The vision to be a world-class commercial and financial service organization that promote promote promotes integrity, honesty, and respect for others. Okay. And the mission to be the leader in furniture marketing, serving the needs of our customer with innovative financial products and service. Perfect. Thank you. Now, team A, Jennifer and Raul. Teacher. I share in the chat. Okay, can you read them, please? Okay, the mission we are a company committed to the growth of our partner so that they can achieve their goals. Sure. Um, to be an, an additionally recognized company characterized by the, the good service product to our partner, helping them to really their dreams reality. Okay, thank you. Very good. Now, Carlos and Wilbur. Okay, en un momento. Me confirman si pueden ver. Yes. Okay. Adelante, Wilbur. Okay. Uh, we are talking about uh, G4S. And uh, the mission to meet our customer security needs by providing integrated solutions. And by doing so, engage our 
shareholder value. The vision is to be recognized as the global leader in providing security solution. Good. Thank you. You're welcome. And finally. Teníamos a Fanny. Pero creo que se nos. Okay. Okay, people. Well, the idea is to to, to learn that uh, the infinitive of purpose commonly commonly is used to express the mission and vision of company. Okay, that is one way to use the infinitive of purpose. I will, ah, Janet uh, put in the chat and WhatsApp the mission. Says to be a government with agile, honest and sustainable governance financially. <laughs> okay, very good. Let me share with you a couple of links to practice some exercises and you can do at home to practice this a little bit more. This is something you can do at home. A couple of exercises to practice this. That is for you to practice on, okay? Very good, let's finish today with the last attendance of the evening, okay? Alba Janet Jimenez. Present teacher. Okay, Alba, good night. Andrea Sofia Benitez. Present teacher. Okay, please don't go. Carlos Ernesto Perez. Present teacher. Okay, Carlos, have a good night. Consuelo good Saray night. Rivas. Present teacher, good night. Good night. Erika de Nilsson, didn't show up. Eric Jose Hernandez. Present teacher, and good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. No me colgues, espérame, no me colgues. Fanny Hola. Judith Palacios. No me colgues, dame un segundo. No, 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 no. Herman Enrique González. No, 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 no. Jennifer Lisset Aquino. Present. Okay, good night, Jennifer. Good night. Jose Abel Izaguirre. Here present teacher and good night. Good See night. See you tomorrow. See you. Jose Miguel Massa. You're present. Good night and see you. See tomorrow. you. Karina Elizabeth Hernandez. Present and good night. Good night. Magdiel Esaú Garcia. Present. Okay. Good night. See you. Good night. Pedro Alexander Osorto. Present teacher, good night. Okay, good night. Raúl Arturo Esquivel. Present teacher. Okay, good night. Reinaldo Antonio Fernández. Wendy Lisette Gómez. Present. Okay, good night. Wendy Maricela Ramirez. Present teacher, good night. Good night. Wilber Alberto Perez. Present teacher. Okay, good night. William Alexander Paniagua. Present. Good night, everyone. Good night. Blanca Alejandra Portillo. Present. Good night. Good night. And Henry Alberto Perez. Present.
Okay, Just good night, sure. people. Good See night, you everybody. tomorrow. Good night, teacher. See you tomorrow. Good night. Sorry, teacher. No, me se me deja el huercel y hasta ahorita entré. Ah, okay, okay. Okay, mañana puede presentar lo que hizo si gusta. Okay, teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. Yes. Okay, Andrea. I don't know if you have any questions. Si hay algo que quisiera reforzar. Dice que sí, me costó entender un poco lo de lo que estábamos viendo el día de ahora de los infinitivos. Ajá, ajá. Entonces, eh, más que todo en, en saber cómo, exactamente cómo, cómo utilizarlos. Cuando es to make, to become, to be, to bring, to spy. Entonces, okay. no sé. Yo leí mal o, o, o me confundí aquí. Bueno, well, uh, veamos. Veamos en el libro. ¿Verdad? Dice, el infinitivo es esta forma verbal, ¿verdad? Cuando utilizamos tú y la forma básica del verbo. O sea, esto, ¿verdad? To make, to become, to be, to bring, to inspire. Esto es lo que se conoce como infinitivo. ¿Ya? Uh -huh. Entonces, dice acá que los infinitivos son usados para expresar propósito. ¿Cómo se hace en las eh, declaraciones de misión? ¿Ya? Uh -huh. Porque el infinitivo nos expresa un propósito. Por ejemplo, la pregunta a la pregunta, ¿para qué existe la compañía? ¿Por qué existe la compañía? Bueno, para brindar oh, inspiración e innovación a cada atleta en el mundo. To bring inspiration and innovation. ¿Verdad? Para inspirar, para traer, mejor dicho, inspiración. Esto es un infinitivo, ¿verdad? Que nos da el propósito de una compañía. Por eso es que se usa en las declaraciones de mí. Pero no solo para compañía, ¿verdad? Ya voy a mostrar los otros ejercicios donde utilizamos este infinitivo para expresar el porqué o el propósito, la razón de alguna acción. También dice acá, los infinitivos son usados para expresar dirección, ¿no? Hacia dónde se va. ¿Cómo se hace en las declaraciones de visión? A la pregunta, ¿dónde va la compañía? ¿Hacia dónde va la compañía? Bueno, our vision is to become the most preferred beach hotel by families by 2020. Nuestra visión es volvernos o convertirse, ¿verdad? En, la, en el hotel de playa más preferido por las familias para el... el 2020. Hacia ahí vamos. La presión es eso. Por eso veíamos estas oraciones, ¿verdad? Hablando de misión, de misión, de propósito. Porque en este tipo de, eh, de, de, de frases que expresan visión y misión, eso es lo que se ocupa. Pero yo les compartía. Eh, ¿Verdad? Otras. Ah. A ver, 
por ejemplo, en este ejercicio. A ver. En este ejercicio tenemos oraciones. ¿Verdad? Donde eh, tenemos infinitivos. ¿Cómo podemos armar estas oraciones? Por ejemplo, yo hice una fiesta de cumpleaños. ¿Cuál es el complemento de esto? ¿Para qué? Infinitivo de propósito. ¿Cuál de estas frases complementaría esta? I made a birthday party. ¿Para qué? To access the, to the online class? No, ¿verdad? No. In order not to live in a dirty place, in order to play basketball, to celebrate Christmas, to surprise my girlfriend, in order not to feel alone, in order to learn a second language. ¿Cuál sería la frase que complementa? Posiblemente tu surprise, my girlfriend. Ok, correcto, ¿verdad? Entonces, ¿cuál es el propósito de que yo hice una fiesta de cumpleaños? To surprise my girlfriend. El infinitivo. Para okay. sorprender a mi novia. O sea que no solo vamos a utilizar los verbos que salen aquí, sino que podemos utilizar cualquier verbo pero siempre tiene que ser en su forma original. Así. Exacto. ¿Verdad? Cuando estamos hablando de del propósito de alguna actividad. Ah, ok. Hoy sí, Alen. Veamos este otro. Yo invité, I invited my friends to my house. ¿Cuál, cuál eh, encajaría? ¿Para qué? To access to online class. To access to the online class. No sé. Me invité a mis amigos a casa para... Uh, acceder o entrar a mi clase en línea bueno no creo veamos si hay algo otra que encaje mejor para no in order not to live in a dirty place para no vivir en un lugar sucio no in order to play basketball para jugar basketball podría ser pero no sé por en la casa to celebrate Christmas puede ser in order not to feel alone para no sentirme solo creo que quedaría mejor esa ok y aquí está entonces el Entonces, okay. esa es la idea. Este es eh, uno de los ejercicios que les he puesto ahí en el, de los enlaces que les he dejado para que puedan practicar. Ok. Eso es lo que, de, eso, de lo que se trata esto. Ok, sí, ya le, ya le entendí. Yo creí que nada más se iba en lo que, por lo que había leído acá en el libro, solo eran los verbos que aparecían acá. No, o sea, cuando... creo que me confundí. Cualquier verbo, ¿verdad? Tiene su forma. Ah, ok. Ok, eso sería entonces el tiempo para esta noche, ¿verdad? Ok, thank you. Ok, Andrea, have a good night. See you tomorrow, ok? Good night. Bye. Bye.